Hey everyone, and welcome to my new video blog series on behavioral technology. Firstly, what the heck is it? Well, at its core, behavioral technology is problem solving for humans interacting with technology in digital environments. On the one hand, we have the nuances and peculiarities of being human, like what keeps us engaged, what makes us anxious, happy or sad, how do we absorb information and find meaning in it, and the impacts of our own biases. On the other hand, we have technologies which are constantly and rapidly evolving, developing intelligent capabilities, often human-like in nature, which are significantly impacting how we work and what work we do. The two sides bring their own expertise to the table and generally approach things differently. HR and change professionals think about process, productivity and experience. IT think about standards, efficiency and security. The behavioral technologist understands both areas and uses a human-centric design approach to integrate the needs of people, the possibilities of technology and the requirements for business success. This fusion of human behavior and technology advancement creates challenging dichotomies for the behavioral technologist. Things like standardization versus personalization, black box algorithms versus ethical AI, productivity versus well-being, control versus empowerment, simplicity versus complexity, and homogeneous versus human robotic teams. It's an exciting field, and the good news is whether you are a people professional, an IT guru, a project manager, a system developer, or simply somebody who has an interest in this topic, you'll learn practical insights that will allow you to increase the value you add to people, your projects, and your business. Stay tuned to this page for the first episode, which will be coming soon. I'll be chatting about why our belief in horoscopes is important for future HR technology. Looking forward to catching up with you soon. Take care.